You're watching News 10 ABC at 9 a.m. Hey, welcome back, everyone. This Friday, Friday the 13th, gets a bad rap. You know, it's known as one of the most <laughs> unlucky dates on your calendar. But a group of artists is changing our luck with a party to celebrate all things spooky this time around. Yes, get ready. This Friday the 13th, the Fusion <laughs> Anti-Gala will be showcasing the best of the Capital Region and all the creativity we have at the Albany Barn. And here to give us a little sneak peek of what's in store, we've got Casey and Macaulay with us today. Thank you for joining us. Thanks for having us. So I want to talk first, Casey, about who the Albany Barn is. People mm -hmm. might not know we have this incredible collective here. So what are the things that you all offer? Yeah, um, so Albany Barn is a, a creative arts incubator. We provide space and services for artists. So that can look like a lot of different things. Um, we have apartments where artists live and work out of, private studio spaces, performance spaces, and then we do a lot of professional development help as well. So if an artist maybe has always wanted to paint a mural on a building but don't really know how to start Start, that's where we come in or we can connect artists to local schools so they can teach um, art to kids so anything having to do with art and supporting artists we cover that's so cool and I got to ask you about this upcoming event what is an anti-gala or is it it's, it's gala, yes. right? yeah okay. I've never yeah. pronounced that right yeah <laughs> yeah so it um it serves a lot of the same purposes as like kind of your typical galas where it's a fundraiser for our organization and it's just sort of a big party with food and music and dancing um, but we call it an anti-gala Gala because um, we want to really just kind of cut loose and have fun and we don't have any kind of you know stuffy programming like you can wear what you want you can be yourself you can just kind of come and eat snacks and party and dance and uh, just celebrate all the things that we've done in the year and I have a question because I am a person who loves to dress up for Halloween even mm -hmm. at 34 years old <laughs> is this permitted can we dress up absolutely yeah, yeah. you wh wherever whatever you feel comfortable wearing please wear so that okay. could be full costumes as long as we can see your face or just you know your little black dress with like a little fun spooky pop spider in your hair exactly <laughs> yeah, yeah. So. Uh, what types of artists are going to be showcased we have um, you know painters sculptors photographers um, a lot of mixed media artists um, a fiber artist really any any yeah. medium you can think of I think we have in, in our in-house so it's really exciting now Macaulay you have brought us a couple of wares artifacts, whatever yeah. you want to call them. What do we have here in the middle? So this also showcases just the breadth of artists we have on display. We hosted a call for art this year, and so we did it around the Friday the 13th theme. Ooh. And so we actually <laughs> created these um, blank masks um, at our Schenectady location. And then we gave them to artists to be able to have fun with. <laughs> and they were able to receive a small stipend for their supplies, their pro whatever they needed. And we have an example of kind of a spookier option and then we have an example of like the fall theme and just like oh, loving beautiful. to describe it. Both artists are um, uh, either residents or have individual artist studios with us at Albany Barn. And so. Yeah. <laughs> Something for everybody. I'm sorry. Yeah. I didn't mean to no. <laughs> <laughs> and you, you have some distracting things over there as well, Mackie. Would, would you mind telling us what those are, Macaulay? Yes. Yeah. So uh, if you are a sponsor or your Catalyst Committee ticket with us, uh, you can go to our art apothecary. That's what we're calling it. Mm -hmm. So you walk in and you get to pick something from it. And so we actually created these little boo buddies. And so they're little felted ghosts. And so you can kind of walk away with something <laughs> Friday the 13th and spooky. <laughs> and then we also 3D printed these cats at our um, Schenectady location. And they're going to be part of the decor because Friday the 13th is about superstition and spooky. Yes. And so we're kind of leaning into the theme this year. Yeah, I love <laughs> it. All things spooky. Now, people want to get involved before we go to break. How can they get tickets? How can they come to the event? Yes, um, albanybarn.org slash fusion is the landing page for the event. You can see all of the incredible artists that are participating. You can purchase your tickets, learn how to get involved. There's so many ways for folks to get involved if you want to come by. Um, so we really hope to see everybody there. Again, Friday the 13th. You don't want to miss this event. Thank you both for joining us. Thank you Thank so you. much. We're going to be right back with a last look at your forecast with uh, this guy, meteorologist Matt Mackey. We'll be right back. <laughs>